Members of the KMT take to the polls tomorrow to choose their next leader. Incumbent Johnny Chang, who's running for a re-election, faces a serious challenge to his seat in the form of party stalwart Eric Chu. Chu has positioned himself as a centrist, and he's appeared to have won endorsement from most of his party's lawmakers. But a hardline dark horse candidate threatens to shut down his hopes for party leadership. KMT supporters clad in ROC flag adorned clothing surround party chairman candidate Zhang Ya Zhang. Party members go to the polls on Saturday, and Zhang supporters are out in force at the Sun Yat sen Memorial Hall. Tomorrow, if you are a party member, you must come out to vote. We must ensure that the blue sky, white sun, and holy red earth of the ROC flag fly not only in Taiwan, but throughout the world. The KMT must not become extreme, it must not go astray, and it must not lose itself to fraud. We must be resolutely blue and resolutely defend democracy and freedom. Jiang on the left, shouting Republic of China. On the right, it's Zhu in a social media ad urging supporters not to become extreme. At the Legislative Yuan, 29 of the party's 38 lawmakers endorsed Zhu for the post. Lined up shouting slogans, these KMT lawmakers make a rare group appearance. Zhu is a favorite for the seat, but Zhang's influence has recently surged. Together, the two have left incumbent Johnny Chang with little hope of a second term. Former chairman Eric Zhu came here to pay his respects, and coming out to welcome him was just a basic show of manners. Many colleagues have already apologized to me because the meeting turned out to be a rally, which wasn't their intention. The KMT members are demonstrating their anxieties over the fate of the party. The situation is that KMT members have concerns about Zhang Ya Zhong. I often joke that the KMT is afraid of Zhong. That Zhong is referring to Zhang Ya Zhong, not the Chinese word for China, Zhong Guo. Fear and loathing could come into play in the vote, which takes place in less than 24 hours.